In our previous tutorial, we have seen how to use Gemini LLM and in this tutorial, we will see how we can use Gemini Multimodel. That means now we can work with both text and images and here we will see one image. We will take that image and we will ask our Gemini LLM to tell us where this image was taken and please give us the description about this image. Let's see how it works. First, I will import OS. Then from get pass, import get pass. And then I will make an object Google API underscore key. And then I will call get pass. And I will pass my Google API key here. And then I will set the environment variable os.environ and then I will copy this as it is from here and then paste it in single or double quotes and then I will assign it to itself. Now we have set our keys in our environment variable. Let's import Gemini multimodel from llama index. I will write here from llama index dot multimodel LLMs dot gemini import gemini multimodel gemini multimodel next i will load or i will call load image urls from llama index dot core dot multimodel llms dot generic utils import load image urls this will help us load our image now i will make an object image underscore urls and inside the list you can pass number of images i'll pass one so i have this image that i have already taken from llama index I will copy this from here, the link or the URL, I will paste it here in this list here and then I can even print this image URL. So this is my URL for this image. Now I will call this load image URLs class and from this I will use a function. So first I will make one variable image underscore documents and then I will call this class load image URL and I will just pass our image URL let us execute our code now we have passed our image URL here and we can get information about this I will just print it image documents and these are the information about this document this is the site from which we have taken now next comes we have to define our multimodel that we can use to identify this image and for that we will be using gemini pro vision now let's make one variable gemini underscore pro and then i will call gemini multimodel because we are using multimodel here and then first parameter is uh, model underscore name and then in single or double quotes you can type here first models slash gemini pro vision then close it and let us execute our code it says that invalid model or not is okay i have made a mistake i have to write here m i did not realize i'm sorry for that now we have created this um, multi-model object here gemini pro this time the api key work now we have to load this image we already have the url but we have to load this image and see once we have loaded this then we can uh, write our prompt for that, I will import from PIL 
import image import request module from io import bytes io import matplotlib dot pyplot as plt and then I will make one object image response image underscore response and then I will call this request module from this I will call the method get and then image URL is equal to or not is equal to image URL at index number 0 then we will print our image URLs and then I will do the indexing here uh, I have to close this so now we have this URL <coughs> let's print it I will make an object image and then I will call image dot so this is the image that we are using here image dot open and inside this bytes io and then inside this image response dot content and then plt dot im show image Uh, it says that plot is not defined because I have to write here this plt not plot and finally we have loaded this image so this is the image that we have loaded here and now we can make our prompt and start asking question whatever you like so uh, let me make a variable complete underscore response and then I will call this Gemini Pro and from this I will call the method complete and inside this my first parameter is going to be prompt where I will write my question I will write the question as identify the city where this photo was taken so I just want to know where this photo was taken and then image underscore documents is equal to image underscore documents and I will close this bracket here and once this is run successfully then we will call response text so we will call this complete response and from this I will call text and here in the output it says that this image is from New York so it has identified correctly this image is from New York and even I can ask more question so identify the city where this photo was taken this should be taken and provide description now we will see more information instead of just the city name let us execute our code Now we have more information. This photo was taken in New York City. The city is known for its tall buildings, busy streets, and diverse population. It is also a major center for finance, culture, and fashion. So you see that how we can use this multimodal to identify image, get description, and there are many more things that you can do with multimodal. And this was just the beginning where you can start using this multi-model using llama index i hope you enjoyed this video if you like my video you can subscribe to my channel thank you for watching